welcome back to my channel. So, um, I put a poll on my Instagram asking what you'd like to see and the overwhelming majority was a Tala review. So, first things first, I guess. <laughs> I have the notebook. <laughs> when I like something, I really like it. Uh, first things, these are the Zinnia leggings, they're iconic leggings, seamless, the grey, um, she's squat proof, you can barely see, look at her go, um, squat proof, really thick, really compression-y, like these are the small size, um, then this is the black aster crop top, it's cropped, it's long sleeved, it's got a zip, it's got it's a lockable zip as well, so you can like, it's not going anywhere, you know? You can wear it for your gym, you can wear it for town, I don't know, wear it whenever. Um, I'm also going to do the prices in pounds for now. Obviously I bought them in euro and at the end I will do a, a sum of how much I've actually spent. But um, just for the purpose of like easiness and conversion and whatever, um, I do the prices in pounds. So this, thirty-five pounds. This, forty pounds. Um, I was supposed to get the black hosta shorts at the same launch, but there was this huge glitch where everybody who bought stuff, um, the size auto glitched to extra small. So we just cancelled that order. Like, no way. <laughs> and you'll see in a sec why. No way. Um, yeah, so Asta, Cydia leggings, they go up. They don't need to go up. We roll them down. Super compression y, very nice, very, very nice. I'm using a camera this week, not my phone, so we'll see how everything goes. Cool, I'll catch you in the next outfit. So I've been taking my size cues from, or I had at the time, from Grace. Uh, she would say, like, I'm wearing a small and I'm wearing a medium and like she's got like bigger boobs so I was like she's wearing a small I could definitely wear a small I could wear a small who <laughs> where no uh, they also all come with these little inserts which for the purpose of the video I'm wearing but they are bad they're poorly made they're like wrinkly they're very obvious I don't know because the lighting in here I don't know if you can see them but there's like <laughs> shapes on me. Um, I've rolled the black zinnias up so that you can see how they look with like a light silhouette behind me. Um, I cannot even get up. I've got nowhere to put my camera. So it's like on top of a chest of drawers which is way too high up for me. These have a story. So this launch was the Blaze launch. This is the second launch. This is one where everybody looked like highlighters. And they had like these slate grey hosta shorts, so I hadn't got my hosta shorts in the previous launch and I was like, I'm getting these grey. They're grey, they're cute. So I ordered, um, I heard nothing. No order confirmation, no nothing. Eventually it came out that there was actually an issue with the hosta shorts themselves. I, I don't know whether the seams were spilling or, I don't know, I don't know, but um, basically I never got them. So they reached out and they were like, what do you want? Do you want a refund or do you want something else and I was like give me the black zinnias you know I got the grey I got the black they were like okay cool send me black zinnias then I got these in July and in November they ripped so I emailed of course because why would you buy something I didn't buy them I know why would you get something um, for them to rip and they were like yeah we can send you a new pair I was like perfect so I I don't know if you can see. No, you cannot. <laughs> oh, there we are. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Okay. So, I did sew them up. I'm gonna have to sew them up again, obviously. I'm not going to any gyms lately, anyway, so that's fine. But, um, two pairs of the Zinnia leggings then for, for 28 euro. Sorry. My child is calling. This is 28 pounds. 
uh, the hostel shorts were 28 as well, but I got the zinnias instead. So I saved 12 pounds. So look, for the sake of 12 pounds too, all right, leggings are not that bad. Catch you in a second. So, do we remember when I said I got my sizing cues from Grace? Small bra on Grace, small bra on me. This bra makes me so uncomfortable. <laughs> it, like, hurts my lungs. So, I think I wore it to the gym maybe twice. It is so, like, they're not going anywhere. They're going back into me, if anything. They're going into my ribs. Then I got, finally, oh, you can't even, I got the shorts. I got the hosta shorts. I got them in small and black. And I feel like a salami being put into its skin. Like, I am so, like, in this. Like, okay, no, 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 no. Um, I think it's worth mentioning as well, I cannot wear any of the talent pants, I suppose, for, um, for running. Because they come up so high, they actually, like, compress my my bottom ribs <laughs> even like wearing them now it's hard to breathe so i've tried a few times and it just i can't breathe so i can't get enough air into my body okay. but yes so this is uh i got these in october i was actually sick when these arrived as well so i didn't have to go to the gym for a while and i just kind of got forgotten about it, it was winter so i wasn't wearing shorts anywhere and um, they're just typical cycling shorts as well like they come to like mid thigh um Impression the same as the black zinnias, they're very, very tight. So the black zinnias are much tighter than the grey zinnias. Um, the bra was 26, the shorts obviously 28, both small, both too small, if you ask me. I don't know who they're supposed to be. Obviously, a smaller person than me, yeah, I get that, but like. <sighs> If you might remember when Grace launched her Jordan Woods vans, she was on this huge, huge billboard in LA wearing this. Every model that wore this, I was like, how do these women, they look so incredible. I must look like this. And the only thing that I asked Matt for for Christmas really was, was this, this, this whole ensemble so we have here the Luna leggings with the little pal of branding. <sighs> oh, I try and do that for everyone. <laughs> and the, what is this? The on the top. When I say salami pushed into skin, they were comfy joggers, okay, compared to this. My arms cannot breathe. I can't wear my watch. I can't get it under the arm. It's got very cute branding up here, but oh my god. <laughs> um, and you've got, of course, your little lockable zip. So, oh god. <laughs> anyway, on the Luna, the Luna is far smaller than the Zinnias. Way, 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 way more compression y. Longer up top, longer down the bottom. Um, I've actually been getting regular on all the leggings as well because I'm short. I'm a short human. 35, 40. So we're talking 75 pounds to look like you've been squeezed into a gray meat tube. Maybe that's your thing. Maybe you're a little bit less thick than me and you're fine. You know, you can move your arms. <laughs> um, this is a small, this is a medium. So this is the Eden. Eden zip top with grey rounding. This was my own Christmas present to myself. Again, I got the small because for some reason I don't think that I have arms. So this is actually on my Depop because I was going on holidays to my best friend's house and I was like, oh, I want to wear something cute. I'll wear, um, I'll wear a tallow top and some high-waisted jeans. It put me in the foulest of humours. I tried on every pair of jeans, everything to make this stupid top work. If you don't have something just like corseting you here you just look I don't know obviously it's quite a short <laughs> it's quite a short jacket so if you move it rides up and I don't know so 
do we want this this here but then you've got this zip it would be cute if it was like a little cropped jacket but it's not it seems to be a full length I really should have a bench or something to stand on but it's another one of those tops that you have to be completely still wearing and not buying clothes to have to stand like a mannequin okay I'm buying clothes because I want to be cute I think we're all buying clothes because we want to be cute okay you can shove people into the tightest of materials. Maybe it's my fault for getting a size too small. But you can shove people into the tightest of materials and they're not going to be happy. Maybe they'll then pay for your workout app and buy your supplements and your weights and your booty bands. Because the clothes are so small, they don't think that they can fit in them without the rest of these things. <laughs> Unnamed brands, by the way. I'm not getting called out here. <laughs> oh. I just wanted to pick her up again because I love her. Here she is. Can you see yourself? Can you see yourself? You can. I could do a whole video like this. So up until right now, we have not had major fallout with Tala. We've been fine. Um, we've had a ripped legging, we've had a non-delivered short, and we've had a basket glitch. Okay, yeah, sure. Understandable, wrong pains, okay. This outfit <laughs> is my crowning delight. So Matt bought me this, the Zahara bra. Uh, it's just the same as the Asta with no sleeves. And I was like, my arms don't fit in those sleeves. So chop them off, lob them off, whatever. Uh, we got a zip. Mm -hmm. Yep, we're fine. We've got the inserts. We ordered these. And I opened up my package and I had these and what are these? These are some slate grey hosta shorts. Cast your mind back to the blaze launch where the hosta shorts just never showed up. Okay, they are now on my body. So <laughs> I emailed Tala and was like, hey, I didn't get a dispatch note. Um, the only thing I got were these shorts and the label with my address on it. And they were like, oh, you're not in the UK. Okay, sure, 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 here, take the top, take the crop top. So they sent me this. <laughs> I believe if you are in the UK, not Scotland, but England, you do have to send them back anywhere else in the world and Scotland, because I know someone in Scotland who didn't have to send theirs back, I guess. 30 pounds. Obviously, this is 30, these are 28. So, if you're gonna buy them separately, that's what. Oh, I'd say these are probably all over the place on me. Um, so these are the C. Look like a little bit of seaweed, I guess. Um, Solasta bra, cute cross bra, double straps, this is in my opinion the most supportive bra because it's it's got double straps it is quite tight i actually got it in the right size so i got it a medium it's got the little inserts in it which are in weird um it's yeah it's longer line so you can wear it like with your leggings or you can wear it with pants you can wear it whatever it's not like a gym bra um but it is that same like thick scuba material so if anybody touches off you yeah they'll know the C leggings and the C zinnias are the same material as the grey. So the grey is much softer. The black is quite coarse. Really like you in. But coarse. Not silky. This is soft. Not much to say about the zinnias. Just that they are what they are. There's a little bit of a branch out with the colours. Um, with a sustainable company, I don't know, you probably want to, I know they want to encourage people to buy, but you probably want to discourage people from buying as well. So I didn't want to buy things that were the very same as something else that I owned. Um, I didn't buy the chai colour because it looks like my skin, but it also looks like the grey zinnias. Um, 
I kind of, I don't know if you can see from my eye, but I try to kind of branch out and get different shapes, different shapes, different styles. Um, like with the exception of there's the shorts and there's two of the Mina bras that I got. Um, I actually got them in two different colors, in two different sizes. I got the pink and the small. I'll show you the one that I got in the medium. But everything else, I really did try to not get the exact same thing over and over again. Because if you're just like wearing the same things in just different shades of white to blacks, like what's the point? Just buy one. Yeah, uh, this is 30 pounds in medium and these are 40 again in small. We come to the Sky launch, which was launched in April, which was like peak world is ending <laughs> apocalypse. So I got the Mina Bra again. I got it in medium this time. Definitely much happier with it in a medium. It's still got the bold branding down here, which was on the pink. Um, I didn't even show you. I'm doing such a bad review. <laughs> here it is. Uh, it's there. Inserts again. Freaky. Not working well. And then I got the lightweight joggers. If there was ever a more disappointing product, it was these joggers. Okay, <laughs> like, I don't know. I I don't know what I expected, but I expected they were thirty four pounds. I expected something. So um, this was twenty eight again. It's the same price as the pink one. One good thing is that they don't actually. Um, not that I've noticed anyway, tend to alter the prices per launch. So sometimes if they would have a limited launch, I don't see them upping the price a little bit where sometimes someone will go, oh, it's limited edition, we're gonna have to push it up by five pounds or something. They don't do that. They stick with the same prices, which is good. Before I go any further, these are refunded. I got these refunded immediately. <sighs> so, I don't know if you can see me through these, but that is the bum of these pants. I know that they're light blue, but if you go further down the leg, you can't see the actual features of my face. If you go over here, you can. So, yeah, okay. So, do you see that? Where is that fabric gone? Who did that go to? Why do I not have it anymore? I'm trying to block my bed as well because I literally just threw all my clothes on the bed. Um, I obviously, I stitched it up because again, I paid 34 pounds for this, but I shouldn't have to stitch something up that I, again, paid 34 pounds for. And this is on the bum, you know? <laughs> like, But yeah, the lightweight joggers, trash, absolute trash. I felt like Princess Jasmine for five seconds. 28, refunded. I think we've well and truly branched away from athleisure wear. I'm wearing a dress. <laughs> So this is the zest dress, I suppose because I'm feeling a bit zesty. Uh, exact same design as all the others, lockable zip, um, it's the cute like choky neck, very nice, very in, very on trend. I don't know why, <laughs> all these people with their long necks come in. I zip this up and I'm like, <sighs> I need like a neck extension. Um, it doesn't come with compartments, holes slots for the little inserts um, you can wear it with a bra without a bra you don't need to wear a bra because it is again it's so like um, I don't know if you can see but yeah, she she squinches you in I've worn this every dinner multiple times um, it's cute yeah no doubt uh, the biggest issue I have with it is because it's so tight it's very tight on your thighs so walking anywhere yeah 
you get the point. As soon as you're going upstairs, that dress is coming up with you. <laughs> Um, yeah. No, I don't know. It's it's cute. It's very cute. It's very summery. Obviously, there's no sleeves. This was forty pounds. <laughs> I don't know that I've ever bought a dress for forty pounds before. No. Forty pounds for a day dress, which I would consider this a day dress. I don't know. But look, yeah, it's fine. Um, it's the same scoop of material as everything. So, if someone holds you, they're they're gonna know you're wearing a scuba suit. But if they're looking from a distance, they're probably still going to know you're wearing a scuba suit. Whatever you're into. So we've tried on the leggings. I'm not going to turn around because, well, you saw how see-through they were. Um, this is the wave crop top. So I got this in the same order as the zest dress. I also got a leaf cloth for £5. Um, yeah, it's cute. It is a reflective. Um, I am wearing a bra underneath it. It doesn't come with insert slots. Is there food? There's food on it. Oh my god. Lockable zip again. It is reflective. Can you can you see that that's reflective? I don't know. So I don't know why I spent 32 pounds on this top. It also zips the whole way down, so <laughs> I'd be content with a half zip, I suppose. It's got the towel branding on the bottom. Uh, it's fitted really really well. Yeah, zip, zip it wherever you want, zip it tall neck, short neck. Um, it's also got this cute little addition here so you don't throttle yourself when you zip it up, which is actually really good because some of the other ones you zip them and they like... So, we're advancing. 32 pounds, it's a medium. Yeah, it's a really good size, it's really comfortable. I've only worn it about twice for some reason though, I think it's the white, the white is daunting me. This is the Zay t-shirt, it is double lined so it's um... It's kind of hard to, like, shape after you wash it because you're all sort of curled up. Um, this is my second Zay t-shirt because, no, you, um, they say you don't have to wear it with a bra. They, <laughs> um, it is said that you don't have to wear it with a bra. I do. Again, that's just me. Um, the first one that I got had this little guy in it. So... Just perfect circle hole, like it had been stapled and the staple ripped out and it was like this. Uh, I've tried to wear it but it is so, so obvious, like it is such, you don't think it's that big of a hole until you put it on and it's like, ugh, my t-shirt has a mouth. Uh, at every point I had the option to either get a refund or a replacement. Um, the only time I didn't have the option of a refund was when my zinnias ripped because they were already a previous replacement. <laughs> they are good about sorting you out when you've you've gotten something wrong or um, they're good about sorting you out when you have issues. As far as I know the refunds on damage only go as far as six months because obviously after that you could be wearing it every day for six months. You could be doing whatever. You come back with a rip after six months wearing it daily like good for you but um with the more like genuine stuff they are very very good i have not had any issues except for the initial hosta shorts where they just didn't communicate anything <laughs> this is the zeal jumpsuit um it's got this is not athleisure wear by the way can i just say you do not wear this to the gym if you do good for you <laughs> i don't even know if you'll be able to hear me but um yeah, it's, oh god, it's a uh, wide leg, it is just shorter than full length on me, I think it's meant to be like here, <laughs> but um, because I'm very short, it is a lot longer, the material is really thick, it's really heavy, it's really nice, the downside to the material being really thick, really heavy, really nice, is that it is heavy, so the straps are thin, um, they are razorback, so like, they're not going anywhere but they're thin and the weight of the material itself actually over the day will drag down so I'll look down and my little pants legs will be on the ground and I have to like like shloop it all all the whole way up it's comfortable but you have to be looking after it like if I want to wear something comfortable I don't want to have to look after it I just want it to be on but this is one of those like you have to look after me sort of things it's comfy got no pockets 
Uh, yeah, 40 pounds. That is everything. Hey, so I'm back. I'm back in my original position too. Sitting down. So I went through all of the prices and I, I don't know, like I hope that it helped somebody because it's really difficult to shop online when you don't have any idea of sizes or what somebody's body type is or height. I also find it helpful for um, looking at what clothes look like on people's bodies. So I know that models or um, even like if you're working with a professional photographer, they're more likely going to style you in such a way that you will look your best. Whereas if you're just flapping about in your house, you're <laughs> like... <laughs> I have unfollowed them on Instagram, so I don't follow Tala anymore because the relentless launches were just too much for me. Like it was just like every single two weeks there was a new launch, there was a new colorway. It just, it got, um, as you can see, uh, it was draining, especially because the girls that they're using in the pictures, like what happened to me with the Grey Marl set, they look amazing and like I want to look amazing when I wear the clothes and I wear it. I, I look like me when I wear them, which is fine, but um, should I really be buying them every single time in the hope that I'm gonna look like somebody else? No, because I'm always gonna look like me. Um, no matter what I do with myself, I'm still gonna be a version of myself, so. Don't buy clothes that are too small for you, that's never gonna work. You just, like I, like with the zip top, you're just gonna be upset every time I go back to it because I'm like, I've never worn this, I wanna wear it, I wanna get use out of it, I've spent what is it, 40? I don't know, 40 pounds? 35 pounds, sorry. I've spent 35 pounds on it, I wanna get the use out of it, and then I put it on and it ruins my day? Like, are you serious? Just buy a bigger top. <laughs> it's a market to prey on people, for sure. Like, if we were just all wearing um, those, like, togas, you think people would be upset in a toga? No. Are people upset in ponchos? No. Why? because they're flattery. You don't know what's going on. You're not worried about your like angle. Nah, bring back the togas, bring back the ponchos. I'm getting off topic. <laughs> so in grand total, excluding shipping, excluding any refunds that I got, including where they charged me incorrectly. So with the Zahara brand, I got sent the shorts instead. I only took the one price, I didn't um, account for the items. I spent £606. <laughs> that amounts to €655 Euro in right now, right now money. If you add in about a tenner per launch, because they do so many launches, but you have to pay for shipping each time. So about a tenner. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's about a hundred extra euro on shipping. I'm not blaming anybody. This is all me. I take full responsibility. I buy things. But um, I can definitely see why the sustainable aspect can be called into question because how sustainable are the shipping practices? How sustainable is it to have to charge so much for track shipping for every single launch where somebody may only buy a notebook? You know? But that's not what this is about. This is literally about the shape and the sizing of the clothing. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> if you have any ideas for my next video, I'm gonna do one on um, my laser eye surgery experience because when I got that done, I also found it very hard to find somebody who's unbiased. A lot of the people on YouTube got their laser eyes done for free. How? I had to pay everything. I had to pay for everything in my life. Um, but yeah, so I find it um, hard to look for an unbiased review. So I'll probably do that at some point. But uh, yeah. Bye.